Meteorologist Tim Jones joins us live from Brickyard Park in Hastings. Tim, how's it going down there so far? You know, Katie, it seems just like uh, yesterday we were celebrating Memorial Day weekend. Now we're to the halfway point unofficially here at Fourth of July. And happy Fourth of July to you, Katie, and everybody else. As we can see here, we're at Brickyard Park, as you said. We got the amphitheater. We've got some music setting up here. That's at seven o'clock. Folks already lining up. Of course, the best seat in the house with the fireworks, which looks to be right over that hill right there. And then we have the folks from the Kool-Aid days set up here, and we've got some vendors as well. So, uh, good event here. People just kind of filing in. The winds have subsided a little bit. In the meantime, let's check out the forecast and uh, with radar. Well, we've got some showers and thunderstorms pushing off from uh, from Colorado and the Nebraska Panhandle, and uh, we obviously expect some of that activity to push in later on. Tonight, as you can see, Doppler 5 live radar is uh, just some shower activity, a few thunderstorms to the west of McCook and west of North Platte. As uh, well, that'll kind of push our area our way, rather, <clears throat> and we expect that to come oh, after 11 o'clock. So for now, we look okay fireworks wise as temperatures are in the 80s, as we expected. Yesterday was kind of that cooler day. Well, now we're getting back into those summer like conditions that those strong breeze, the strong southerly winds we have are bringing back in that humidity. And you can feel it out here, but it's going to be even worse the next couple days. So the forecast for tonight, well, the cooler temperatures are gone. We'll be back in the 60s overnight tonight. Well, again, those showers and thunderstorms pushing in from the west. Some could be strong, too. We could see some strong winds and some large hail out of that as well. I don't expect any, at this point, widespread severe weather, but it's always possible. As uh, <clears throat> tomorrow through the day, well, we'll start off in the 70s in the morning. We'll give way to 80s for the noon hour, and then we'll top off in the low to mid-90s. So a warm, humid day, not quite as windy. But, Katie, it's nice out here. Wish you could be here. Wish Colin could be here, too. And coming up in Maine weather, you know, I'm going to always talk to somebody, and I think we're going to talk to the folks from Kool-Aid Days, because even though we're here at Brickyard and talking Fourth of July, well, <clears throat> Kool-Aid Days is right around the corner, so who better to talk to than the folks from Kool-Aid Days, because we got to get our, hey, Kool-Aid on, Katie. <laughs>